welcome to the eighth and last location. Technically, there is another one, but this is the last location of the main story. So, the real challenge is about to start. Okay, so there is some free land in Oricon, and we must defeat the others in this contest to be able to get that land. So let's find what we need to do. Go to the store with pick a bull head. Probably this one. Let's head right into the store. Maybe before checking out this building. Okay, this one is a treasure part. We have chairs which I think are just for obstacle purpose. Let's open this up. And that's the treasure part. You should see a treasure part there, but I have already got it, so... Um, still don't think there is any bonus. Three chairs are not enough to surround the table. And nowhere else will the chair fit. Okay, that's where we can sign up. Let's go. So we have mined three nuggets in the previous location. So that's the fee. Hmm, some fox have fried dynamites. So people are like, we have to get the land by hook or by crook. Now this looks like a bonus here, there are these small brown spots which are hardly noticeable, which give a bonus. So up next we can go start, where is Pedro? Um, I don't know where those tiles are accessible from. Probably not even accessible for now. Let's see. Just in time, go to the starting area number two. So, is it like we are going to race along with them? Okay, the race has started already and Dick is the one most behind. And he's going to go further behind to get those tiles. Don't worry, other racers are not going to run away. I am even trying to find out if there is a bonus with these stones instead of racing. Mm, I haven't found anything yet. Two similar looking objects. I think. So I guess we shall move on. If I find something later, I will put it in the comments or the description below. So, do check that out. And that's a race through the mountains and forests. Some people are going upwards and we are going rightwards. Oh, I'm not sure if we are on the right path, but let's check it out. And they have thrown a stone in our path to block us. We can't climb the hill because of that stone. Here's an alternate route. We are probably on the right path. I wonder what was up there. Ok, 
Okay, he seems to have thrown a log in the river and destroyed that bridge. We possibly can just cast the other one. Let me just dig up the tiles before we proceed. This is probably where the others came from and this is not where we are supposed to head. Uh, I am confused. Where exactly are we supposed to go? This is where the other resource came from and this is where we are supposed to be headed. I don't know, it's just confusion. Right now we need some dynamite to get rid of these stones. This section is probably going back to the starting place where the other went to north and we went to the east. Yep, looks like so. That stone is there for no reason. I think it was probably designed to block our way. But since we never went there, nobody could block it. Now in search of the dynamites, let's continue further towards the right side and see if we can find any dynamites there. looks more like a labyrinth to me than a race but hey I just found the dynamite uh -oh. so this is the guy with the dynamite and because of that beer he lost his dynamite we are going to take advantage and grab that hmm so I guess that was all for this section. Now we have to go back and use the dynamite on the rocks in this section. This one is not a big location, just 348 tiles long. Okay, let's use that up. One, two, I didn't check the count how many we got, but let's use as many as we can. Three, and that's the golden revolver. Four, that opens up a way. So let's head continue. Um, have we been in this area? No, it doesn't look like something we could ever get to because there are no tiles in that section to the right. This one looks like one of the bandits that we had caught. They are racing along with us for the free land. And instead of racing they are now planning to steal the horses. Horses are not even close to the value of land. But yeah, that's their way of minimizing the losses. So we have blocked three participants so far. And we must block two more and get to the land first.
Okay, that guy just landed up on the other side and looks like we have successfully blocked all other participants and we have the first one here so let's plant the flag and the land is ours yay great we have already built a house and a well That completes the quest. No double reward for some reason. And this was the 100th event ever of Tinky's Adventure when it was originally released in 2019. So they just had a bonus location to celebrate. We will check that bonus location too in the next video. So for now, thank you for watching and see you in the next one.